All right now, five, the deal is dead. Novant Health is dropping out of a $320 million acquisition of two hospitals in Mooresville and Statesville. Thanks for joining us tonight for your news at five. I'm Alicia Barnes. And I'm Morgan Francis. The deal comes after the Federal Trade Commission worked to block the purchase. We spoke with those who live in the area about what this means to them. In an emergency situation, minutes matter. No one knows that better than Greg Thomas, who once rushed his wife to Lake Norman Regional Medical Center. They've been pretty good here. My wife had an emergency some years back, and the doctors here saved her life, basically. For years, Novant Health has been trying to buy Lake Norman Regional Medical Center and Davis Regional Medical Center. It's a $320 million deal that's now dead after the Federal Trade Commission got an appeals court to freeze the acquisition. I guess I have mixed feelings. Uh, I like the name recognition and Novant and, uh, but if it's gonna stifle competition, which is what people are saying, which the FTC is saying, I, uh, I buy that. The FTC stated that the merger of LNR into Novant will exceed the FTC's merger guidelines that indicate a merger is presumptively likely to have anti-competitive effect. Those guidelines spelled out in a 51-page document help the commission examine when a merger will lessen competition or limit products and services. We don't have many choices up here. That's a concern people in Mooresville think about when deciding where to go for medical care. I don't think the hospitals are gonna fix it. Healthcare premiums, Medicare included are very expensive. A spokesperson from Novant Health stated it's their belief that these facilities and their patients would have greatly benefited from joining Novant Health. Adding with FTC's continued roadblocks, we do not see a way to finalize this transaction.